All right, let's start on our task to clone Get the Ghost. Now, we assume you've actually played the game or watched the video that shows the game. You've had a good look at it, and you know everything you have to do. So, here's the solution. File. New project. New. Looks like a good place. Get the ghost. Version 1. We're going to build on this throughout the course. So it's a good one to have made yourself. Create. All right. First step. Load those sprites up. Create sprite. I know there's wall pieces. So let's go grab those wall pieces. I know there's a boss near the top there. I know there's a ghost hanging around. Where's some ghosts? Ghost floating. I know there's a player at the bottom. I don't care which one you use here. Ah, let's make the game hard. No, let's make the game easy. Small bat. I know there's two types of lasers that are going to come out. Actually, I think you've only seen the one laser, the player lasers. So let's go for a laser blue. And let's see if I got everything. I got the boss, the ghost, the walls, the player, the blue laser. Later on, we'll be adding some other lasers, but that's good for now. Now, of course, we got to make the objects. Object wall. Walls are going to be the only thing that are solid in the game. So remember, that's one of those beginner things that a lot of people forget to tick. Solid wall. Object player. Object laser blue. This is so easy, but it's so much work. Object ghost. I'm stalling here. Object boss. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Looks good. Now let's make the room. Now for the size of the room, you might have noticed I just left it the regular size. Didn't want to create too much work. Normally on the settings tab, you could set the size of the room here. Okay, so I've just left it 640 by 480. We'll just keep it small. And let's plunk some objects in. Let's start with the walls. I had a wall up there. Whoops. Delete it. Nope. Whoops. There we go. Wall there. Another wall there. It's okay if the walls hang outside the room a little bit. Nothing wrong with that. And down here we have the player. I'm trying to see if I can get my walls down there. Sorry for the spaz out here. Let's delete these. A fast way to delete is you can actually just hold the shift key and delete a whole bunch. Okay, that's pretty good. I'll put the boss in. And you'll see I made a few ghosts there just for fun. Just plunk a few ghosts to start. Okay, and let's get the player in. 
And there we go. I can change the background to black. And there we go. Get the ghost. Not too bad. Okay, pretty fast setup. In the next video, we'll start coding all the actions in.